shit! Live from my mom's basement. Is that once again? Pizza Lover 69, and today we are playing Call of Cthulhu. Chapter 1 PS Investigation Agency Boston. I know it sounds like I played this before, and yet I have. <laughs> Not as much as I wanted to, but that just got. So is this is chapter one. Um, I would like to thank you for watching. No, I won't. Yes, I will. Thank you for watching. <sighs> this is gonna be awesome. Uh, I haven't played a horror game in a while, so yeah, we just we're just gonna do this and be fun and be good, be good at it. Sure, I don't know. Let's do it. Chapter one. P.S. Investigations Agency Boston. I need my glasses. Oh shit. Enter the madness. If I'm mad, it is mercy. May the gods pity the man who in the calculousness can remain sane in the hideous end. H.P. Lovecraft. Okay, this is... This is intense. Oh, okay. Oh, where we at? Oh shit, that's the dead shark. I believe this is a survival horror. I don't think it's something like Outlast, but we shall see. Game saved. <laughs> I haven't even done anything yet. All right, let's do this. Cool, 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 cool. Push to move, okay. What are we looking for? Fish? Yes. I think we've entered the layer of the potions. Be cool, 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 cool. Probably down here, be to crouch. Wait, before we go to the locked gate. Alright, so you light up things in order to interact with them. Cool. So, we need the lantern. Hurricane lantern. Oh, <laughs> what? Begone, demon! <laughs> okay. What? Uh, okay, we can lean. This is burn. Um, no jump. The run button. Okay, we can run. So now we got tools. Okay, let's cut this bitch open. Okay. Hello. Okay. Uh. Wait. Oh, we came from that. Okay, that's fine. Run, 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 run. <laughs> this is quite exciting. I have no idea what we're getting into. Probably death and this. Memberment Killer Whale. Oh, then, damn, damn, that's bright. Let's move along. Okay, I have been chosen. Run. Okay, we well, let's get out of here. Oh, shit. Okay. Right. Where's everybody's faces? They're like Voldemort. He has a face. <laughs> 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 he 
He died too easily. Alright, let's get ready to run. Alright, just a dream. It's good. We we need some drink to calm down. Cool. Uh consult diary. Okay. Um, I feel like this is gonna be a game where I'm I'm just gonna flash through the things. I'm gonna read everything like this interaction. The Wentworth Agency doesn't attract top-notch cases. Cool. That is it. You see? I used to be an avid reader. Cool. Um, close. All right, so we can open stuff and lean. What does this say? The lost battalion. Holding your position and obeying orders. That is encouraged. Okay. Been too long since I've slept in a bed. Why have we been sleeping on the floor? A married woman runs off with her girlfriend. The husband couldn't understand it. Off with... Married woman runs off with her girlfriend. Her husband couldn't understand. Oh, oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. No judgment here. No judgment here. This music is so annoying. Thank you. Damn. Back to my investigation. Another case file. Old story of blackmail in a speakeasy. Cool. Blackmail. Natural sciences, linguistics. I'll be on technology. with. Wait. Been a while since I jotted down something other than my nightmares. Oh, okay. Um, cool, 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 cool. Uh, pizza lovers, hello? Maybe. Maybe. That's correct. All right, that's correct. Hello. Hello, Lucy. Uh, excuse me. Why? How convenient! Right. I'm so very sorry, but I have to collect your personal information yet again. Okay. Uh, what is this? This is the thingy. Um, looks like a skill-based system. So, I'm gonna do spot hidden. I don't know what the. Wait, wait, wait! wait. I'm gonna need this. Okay, all the weak stuff I'm boosting. You go, you go, you go, you go, you go. No, 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 no. Yes. And then... I got nothing left. Wait. Remove. There we go. There we go. That looks like... Uh, um, a good thingy, okay. Um, validate. Uh, do you really want to validate this character? Yes. Cool, cool, cool. If you want. What's wrong? Okay. So? Work is scarce. Like what he said. You know as well as I do, there's never been more investigative work than now. But are those cases <laughs> Someone is tooting. Not losing your license. Show yourself worthy of the Wentworth Detective Agency, and we might keep you on the payroll. Ooh. Damn. I'm coming. Hello, good sir. Sir, I came here on the advice of a person whom I hold in high esteem. And I must say that I expected anything but a drunkard's lair. I take offense to that. You're free to leave any time, sir. Do you know to whom you speak? No. Sir, Mr. Industrialist and art collector. All of Boston knows you. Tell me, Mr. Pierce. Are you capable of handling a new case, or are you simply a deadbeat inebriate? Oh! If you come to me, it means you're desperate. Yeah, Nobody you... Nobody believes me. Uh, uh, take me for an old fool. You are a fool, Sarah, insulting me. Girl. She is dead. My condolences. You must know of her. 
No. She was Sarah Hawkins. <gasps> Sarah Hawkins, the painter. Yes. Everyone knows her one. Clearly, everyone knows. Police accuse her of killing her family. They all died in a fire. Okay. Sarah, her husband, and Simon, my grandson. I can't do anything for a woman who was already dead. Find out the truth. Cool. They say she was mad, but I know that's a lie. You would never have done such a thing. But if you have no proof, I've brought all that I have. Look. Okay. I want you Show me. To look carefully at this painting. All right. Ah, uh, looks like the dream I just had. Assumptions that come to mind. Ah, uh, creepy, disturbing. Uh. How am I supposed to find? Tell me. Tell me if this is the work of madness. Okay, it's work of madness. On the contrary, you managed to detect some logic, a rationality to follow, so that I may understand it. Is that all you want from me? Yes, please. All right, I'll look at your picture. Okay. That's all you've got. The painting. I placed a file on your desk. It contains everything I have on the affair. Then why'd you let me walk all the way there? A warehouse on Dark. Some sketches of the Hawkins family. Rather thin. Okay. Alright. Time to examine this. Oh, okay. What's this symbol on the man's chest? It's I have... as if Sarah Hawkins breathed a message into it. So, Mr. Pierce. Okay. What do you make of these elements? Uh mm, do we have unlock? Um unlocked answer, alright. Uh, painting you sh you shoot oh okay. The meaning could be exactly as it appears. I think your daughter is sending you a message. Uh, oh, what I believe too. What message? It was three months ago that I received the call from the police telling me of my daughter's death, and yet a short while after, this painting was delivered to my home. Okay. The painting is linked to this case. Can't you see? You must find the meaning behind all this. I will try. Um, where did Sarah Hopkins live? Something's not right. The story I read about her. Um, the sender's label mentions Warehouse 36. Yeah, Warehouse. That's right. It came with Sarah's last painting. And you think your daughter could have been the sender? That is what you must find out. Okay. Go to Darkwater. I'll go. Find Warehouse 36. Maybe. Um. I feel like that's all the information I need. Uh, so. All right, let's go. Her husband was a big deal on the island. But the police are sticking to the accident theory. Don't, don't buy it. Sarah's mental state was fragile. Fragile. I you are right, sir. This case is not as simple as it appears. I am aware of that. I believe there is more to this case than just an accident. All right, that is all the information I need. I'm beginning to understand. I'm willing to do anything for my daughter to recover her honor. Quiet down. I'm on your side. Let's sum things up. An artist dies with her family in a house fire. Okay. Your only clue is a sort of painting. Monterey painting sent from Darkwater right before her death. Mm -hmm. And the rumors about her supposed folly. What is a folly? Totally deny. Find that warehouse. Find out the truth regarding Sarah Hawkins' death. You will be handsomely compensated. Ooh! I'll take the case. Yeah, pfft. when money's involved, I'll take it. Look into the death of your daughter. Thank you, Mr. Pierce. I didn't expect any less coming from a man in your situation. Thank you. But it's not like I have a choice. All right. Leave. I think I've got a book on the North Atlantic. I'll no uh, doubt find some information on this island in there. Dark water is off the coast of Boston. Cool. But I've never heard of it. According to this book, it was often mentioned during whale hunting times at the end of the 19th century. Feels like a dream I had. Things have been shunned since then. Okay. All I have to do is go to the port. I just hope that I can find a boat able to take me to dark water. Me too, man. Me too. I did another book right here. Okay. I just got a skill. 
That's not what I meant. Hmm, <laughs> deceased. 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 Cool. <laughs> Let's do this. Alright. Leave for dark water. Gained one CP. What is a CP? ICP. Uh, investigation point. Um. To the next chapter. That was that was a fast chapter one. Okay, well we're, we're giving it double bill chapter. There we go. Yeah, double bill chapter. Double bill chapter. Okay, what's up next? Pierce took the Hopkins case. The curse arrests is accused of having caused a fire that killed her and her family. As the only clue, she left her father a disturbing painting on the shipping label and address a warehouse on the set of the docks in the island of Darkware. The place seems to be starting point for Pierce's investigation. Sweet. So there's an investigation about a painting about death, whale bones, and a cult. And something called Cthulhu. Sweet, sweet, swat, swat. I got it. Now we just wait for the load. Murder, son of a bitch, load. So I got the thumb now. Into the madness. Oh, not yet. <laughs> Damn it, I got carried away. Into the madness. In a world where boats go through fog without a searchlight, one brave man sets sail to water. He is a man on a boat. Focus Home Entertainment presents. <laughs> like a horror movie. I like it. I got goosebumps again. Oh yeah, let me get that sig, yo. A game by Cyanide Studios. This is such a, a lurking game. It's like it's spooky. It's I, Captain Fitzroy. Sick of weed. <sighs> Land ho! Is that an island? Call of Cthulhu. Cthulhu! Ooh, I don't know what, what sound a Cthulhu makes. I'm not. Is Cthulhu uh, a squid god? I'm pretty sure it is. The Sila. Alright. Looks like the boat has meaning to it. Oh, there's a fog light. This is some creepy ass island shit. <laughs> Let's explore. That box looks like it has nothing inside. There's guys coming to unload. Okay. Yo, Captain, what's up? Welcome to Darkwater Island, Mr. Pierce. Ah, thank you. Why, thank you, Captain Fitzroy. Why, thank you, Captain Fitzroy. So, what wind brought you? Um, the oh, northern wind. Does case mean anything to you? Uh, a sad story that we would all prefer to forget. Charles Hawkins may have been a Welcome to Darkwater. <laughs> this place is creepy. I like it. And his wife, Sarah Hawkins. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, a nice young woman and a great painter. What a tragedy. What another whale. Excuse right. me, Captain. Go have a drink of the stranded whale. No, thank you. you need I'm on the job. Me up. Mm -mm. Mitchell may not be very welcoming, but his bar holds a surprise for you. As for me, 
You'll find me at the Harbor Master's office. Harbor Master. If it's the Hawkins family that brings you here, uh, excuse me. A pile of documents that should interest you. All right. Understood. I'm going for a look around the docks. Okay. Talk to Fitzroy. Okay. Uh, go to the bar. Talk to Bradley. Excuse me, sir. Are you Bradley? No. Oh, a lantern. I uh, guess it's not for now. Something to interact with. Prohibition is just a joke around here. That suits me fine. Cool. Bradley. Oh, okay. Fine. I don't want to go there anyway. To the bar we go. Wait, who's Bradley? Bradley! Back up, boys. Back up. You want some help, Sullivan? All right. No I'm examining this. I'm the coroner. Step aside. The blood is just beginning to coagulate. Coagulate, yes. A short time ago. Mm -hmm. Only a specialist would know what killed him. Only a specialist. You can't understand. You're not the same goes for you, sir. Oh, you Bradley. Um Ask okay. Don't treat me like another one of these locals. Oh. You're completely overwhelmed, and you could do with reinforcements. Yes. What are you thinking? That you can call the National Guard to an island like Darkwater? Maybe. For a stranded fish? Gosh darn, Mr. Not like another one of these locals. Go give your valuable advice somewhere else, huh? Oof. Now, please, allow me to do my job. You don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. You shysters, you're crazy. Listen to the crazy man. Well, that, 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 uh, pfft. conversation went south. Hello, welcome. Ooh. What an ominous song. Hey, Salaman. Whoa! Are you... You wanna get smacked up? Oh... Hey, be careful. <laughs> Hello there, missus. You look like my next extra wife. My bar, we don't serve troublemakers. Okay. Um. Hold to test eloquence. Hold it strength. Um. I'm just gonna say I'm sorry. Pure instinct. I behaved like a hun, and I sincerely apologize. Veteran, huh? 307th Infantry Regiment. At your service. Well, that'll be okay for now. But the war is over. I'm try not to forget it. I'm here for information, not for a fight. Yes. I prefer it that way. Yes, you do. Speak then. I reserve the right to answer or not. <laughs> Sounds like a riddle. Um. Uh. Do you know where this place is? Warehouse 36. Please. Darkwater Harbor. Do tell. The Hawkins Warehouse. I see. Yeah. If I were you, I wouldn't hang around there. Why not? Why not? First off, there are rumors. All sailors from around here say you can hear noises coming from the warehouse at night. Screams. That sort of thing. <sighs> all right. That sounds like a Scooby-Doo mystery. And that's not all. There's the fate of its owners and all the superstitions that go with it. But I'll say no more. 
Okay. Uh, yes. Um. No prohibition. I don't. No, I don't know what that means. I didn't expect to find alcohol on this island. What's the source of this miracle? Oof. Who? Our source of supply wouldn't like me to betray them to the first comer. I'll tell nobody. She'd know it anyway. Anything else? Um, find them all but dark water. Um, Sarah Hopkins. We all knew she was famous on the mainland for her paintings. Cool, cool. Never understood why. Then, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. Uh, it's true what they say. All right, let's go. Her vision. Was it so terrible? The way I see it, the truth is really a question of point of view. Cool. What do you mean by that? Some deep stuff. You still trust the truth after a bottle of whiskey? Uh, no. Uh... I'm just gonna say enough. I've got what I need. Anything else? Uh... Sound whale. I guess this bar has been here a long time. What can I tell you? I'm a nostalgic sort of guy. The name, it reminds us of the golden age of dark water. Dark water. The whalers left for long months and came back sweating and stinking of the oil and flesh of the whales they'd been hunting. Yeehaw. It was a tough time, all the same. <laughs> ah, but steeped in glory. We've never known such wealth since then. Um, I'm good. That'll be all for now. Thank you. I think I need to talk to this lady. She knows what's good. What's good, girl? What you looking at, stranger? Um. She can certainly put them away. Uh. I've rarely seen a woman who can hold her liquor so confidently. What gives you the right to judge me? Ah, it was a compliment. So what? Let me drink, stranger. <sighs> Wait. I told you to beat it. Dick. You bet your sweet ass I'm coming back. Hmm. Nightmares. He has things and voices whispering. What's his own name? It's reader and appear at various locations. Gifted with its own consciousness. Until it finds a new reader. Okay. The miraculous catch. Apparently, the most significant event of the last 80 years. Cool. I'm, I'm not going to read. I don't want to speak to Dam. Uh, let's get to Fitzroy. Fitzroy! She won't stop asking. Not that again. She will get us into trouble. I know. Okay. Cool. Charles Hawkins was a heavy drinker and a debtor. Interesting. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Nothing else but to go to Fitzroy. Fitzroy. First, I'm gonna search the place. What's this? A cella. A cella. It finished up beached at the entrance to the harbor. Yes, I knew it. This blackboard hasn't been used in a long while. Mm-hmm. Fishing equipment. <laughs> Could do with some rust remover. Hello? Ah, it's just the toilet. Let's leave you some privacy. Um, what's this? Broken. This place seems half abandoned. I wonder what Captain Fitzroy has got to say about this woman, Cat. Okay, Cat. It's probably the woman sitting at the bar. Um, first I'm gonna search a little more. Hello. 
I learn something new every day I pick up a book. That's some good information. This man and Fitzroy could be twins. Maybe they are. What a macabre souvenir. What's this? Oh, it's a pig leg. Okay, nothing left but to question. Wait, wait. Nothing left but to question the man. On to the next adventure. Hello. I brought out the Charles Hawkins cargo manifests. Thank you. Next to you. But in truth, you're likely to be disappointed. When you're done, come join me on the deck. Okay, Kazaski. These manifests are signed by Charles Hawkins. Charles Hawkins. That's all I'll get from them. The father. Um. Let me get the door for you. Here you go, good sir. <laughs> so, how do you do? Me here, I see everything that goes on in the harbor. The harbor. The lives of my sailors. The fights of the stranded whale. Even the antics of these war rats don't escape me. Okay. It's who lays down the law around here? Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I'm just the last serving captain on dark water. Okay. Tell me what I can do to help you? Um. Your manifests have been blacked out. Mm. They're totally unreadable. Yeah, I saw that. I've got no idea who did it or why. I don't remember having countersigned anything special enough for someone to hide it. And so, why obliterate the dates? It's a bit fishy. Stored in the warehouse. It's a bit fishy. The dates have some meaning. What meaning? Uh. I know that Charles Hawkins was descended from a family of ship owners, and the island's fishing industry was hit badly. Cool, Indeed, cool. We specialized in whaling. Whaling. We went out to sea after the miraculous catch of 1847. What is the miraculous where catch? Where did the Hawkins family get its money? Well, from what Charles inherited, I presume. Although these dates on the manifests could indicate that he had contracts of another kind. Ooh la la. Um, warehouse. I'm looking for warehouse 36. You know where it is. Look, it's right there. The warehouse is opposite the jetty. You can't okay. So, Understood. how am I getting past these guys? The building belongs to, don't you? The Hopkins? Um, it, okay. <laughs> you underestimate me. I have not, um... It belonged to the Hawkins family. Precisely. Precisely. I that somebody here wanted me to search this warehouse. Why? Um. Uh. I was looking at your photograph. The one of the man in front of the boat. Ah, yes, I can see the one you're talking about. Who is he? Interesting resemblance. I thought it was you. But was it you? A wooden leg. And for good reason. That's my father in the photograph. Okay. My father. John Fitzroy, captain of the Scylla. Captain of the Scylla. You can go and see it if you're interested. No, I did. Um. I'm just back from the wharves. The dead killer whale is unsettling the sailors. Ah, yes. Us men of the sea are superstitious folk. Killer <laughs> whales don't have many known predators. No, they do not. That's true. Except giant oh, Cthulhu's. They're not found around here. But no. then, you're going to take me for a fool. Give it a try. Have you heard about the depths? Trenches that plunge into the earth and that shelter creatures unlike any other. You're talking about mythology. No, Cthulhuism. Indeed, you're right. Okay. Uh, why the, the police, police took the decision to put the killer whale back into the sea. Why? You've got to understand them. They didn't know what to do with it. Me neither. I think that was a mistake. Yes. Who says that whatever caused those wounds is no longer in these waters? Because you're summoning Cthulhu. You think we should have kept it? Maybe. To look into the real cause of its death, at least. Yeah. Um, return. Uh, what is the, the miraculous, miraculous sketch? Is it a local legend? 
Not at all. Uh, excuse me, I'm feeling a bit gassy. <gasps> I need to watch that. Story of the sailors return to Darkwater Harbor. It's displayed on a wall of the stranded whale. Uh, I did read it. Uh, who is Cat? I found a threatening letter signed by a certain cat. What? I don't mind you visiting my harbor master's office, but I prefer if you didn't go through my affairs. Okay, my bad. Not exactly, no. That shyster wants to make us pay protection money. With any success? I wouldn't say that, but she terrifies my men as much as her own. Can you not do anything to stop her? Don't you worry about that. Okay. Uh, I got what I've... I shall be on my way. Thank you. So come back and see me when you've got something new. Will do, Captain. Will do. Doodle 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 doo. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. You shysters, you're crazy. How could you be dumb enough to leave the entrance to the warehouses unguarded? Keep your voice down. Why not go and shout at the cat while you're at it? I don't want to end up with her little knife under my throat. It's a stiletto, you idiot. <laughs> and with that smell on your breath, I don't give you much chance anyway. Okay. Let's talk to them, I think. <clears throat> No idea. You better keep it shut. What's with you wandering around here like a hungry dog? Um. Mm. I've got to get inside. It's your boss who sent me. Oh yeah. And why didn't she say anything to us? I don't she know. Sent me to see who's filching her stock. I. Don't know what you're talking about. You got no proof to back up your claims, and I'd advise you against snitching. Or what? If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another way. Okay. Excuse me, Rock. Sailor? Um, oh shit, okay. You just do you. Then, uh... hmm. Well, that was easy. Find hidden items. Hello, old friend. Obtain but of like okay so <coughs> excuse me, can we open up something else? <coughs> excuse me again. Seems so creepy these open waters, I don't like it. Mm. Saint Brendan. Ah. All right. Lean, lean. I'm a mean spleen regenerating machine. Um, how do I get rid of? Oh. oh okay. Oh, so you tap. Wow, wow. Alright. I got some booze. <clears throat> What's with you wandering around here like a hungry dog? Uh. Cat. She's your boss. What? You listen through keyholes. She's the boss, yeah. She says who goes in or not. Okay. Shut up, you dummy. You wanted to know that you also talk too much. She must be quite intimidating if she can make two men like you tremble. <laughs> she really did the smile at the last one who wanted to get in. 
I hope you had a good dentist. No, no, you don't understand. She really cut him a new smile. But he only smiles with the left cheek. <laughs> okay. Um... Who does this belong to? Wait. She sounds frightening, your boss. And she doesn't like to be talked about behind her back. So, who are you? Are you stupid or are you doing it on purpose? Maybe. Everybody knows us on Darkwater. No, I don't know I you. Just arrived. Yes. Let's just say we're standing guard for the owner of the site. And we let no one enter her property. I've got to enter the Hawkins warehouse. I guess it's going to be complicated. No, it's very simple, in fact. Fuck off. Ooh. I don't give a damn about your racket. I just want to get into this warehouse. And we don't give a damn about you. Whatever your reason for wanting inside, there's nothing we can do for you. Fa okay. I bid you, gentlemen, farewell. I bid you adieu. If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another one. Okay, another way. Mister. Where do you think you're going? Um. Who are these others so interested in the warehouse? Yes, do tell. Why would I tell you? Um. We're on the same team. You and I are on the same side of the law. Oh yeah. You don't want to know the truth behind this case. Are you saying our work was not up to snuff? Forget it. Okay, damn. I'm not here to hinder your work, officer. Edward Pierce, private detective. Sorry, we're all a little on edge today. What are you doing here? I'm investigating the death of the Hawkins family. Yes. Darn it. Why do you want to drag up all that stuff again? Uh, I'm being paid. Led me to this warehouse. That case was closed months ago. Lies. Lies. What more can you say about the death of the Hawkins family? Accidents. Not much more than what everyone knows. I wasn't on the case. They were all burnt to death, right? Up at their place. The whole mansion went up in flames. Don't get it into your head to go wandering around up there. It's dangerous. Okay, I what won't. Do you mean by that? The only one left there is old Silas. And the accident has affected him badly. You good, Silas? It can be unpredictable. Especially if a stranger starts poking around the property. Is he a danger to the public? No, he's in his own home. Do yourself a favor. Leave him well alone. Okay. Thank you, officer. You've been uh, much help. They can't understand. What could have done so much damage? You can't understand. You're not I don't know. Maybe it's a baby Cthulhu. Worth a try. Oh, okay. It looks like there's a way in under this grate. Okay. I could use this old winch to lift the grating, but it's been completely taken to bits. There must be some spare parts amid all this clutter. Okay, spare parts. Um, okay. We need this. This handle will be perfect for the winch. A ratchet device. Exactly what I need. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. A whale vertebra. A whale vertebra. If the newspaper clipping in the bar is true. This bone is a real fossil. Cool. Maybe it's worth money. It should be possible to mount this cogwheel on the winch. That's what she said. Okay. Close on. Wait, we need some light. 
Um, uh, Looks like everything is in its place. All I have to do is turn this handle. The right, continue. Well, that was easy. Okay. This is... This is... Well, this isn't gonna explode. Let me bring my lighter down. <coughs> Whew. Am, I, am I dying? Get... 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 Whoa, no, no, that's deeper. Um... <coughs> Smoke. It's coming from this oil. I hope it's not toxic. <coughs> um. <coughs> Maybe we should run. Um. Yeah, let's get out of here. Where are we going? I don't trust this. Hello? <gasps> ah! <gasps> oh shit! What the? Oh my Gustav! <gasps> what the? Oh! Um, oh yeah, let's, um, shit, okay, continue on, nothing happened, it's just seaweed, we're just, um, hallucinating, what's this, what shit, what's that, did we need a gas mask or something, I don't know, um, carvings, this is primitive, Ancient aliens. Let's get out of here. I wonder where we are. Okay. I'm, I'm just confused. I don't even know where I'm going. Wait. Oh, this place stinks. Oh, wait, that's the, the connection between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case. No idea. We shall find that out. Jump. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Ooh. Huh? The glass is shattered like someone smashed it. Was it before or after the removal of these bandages? Hmm. I don't know. This is some... Um, CSI type shit. What is this picture of Charles and Sarah Hawkins doing here? Hmm. Creepy ass paintings. one of Sarah Hawkins paintings? I don't know. But it is creepy. It smells as bad as it looks. Who has enough money to buy painkillers, but stays in a place like this? Can't sleep. I know how that feels. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm certainly confused. Um, the door. I probably should go through the door. Uh, someone has settled in here, and whoever it is has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? You don't move. The Hawkins case has been wound up. 
Let the dead rest in peace. Uh, some. Let's team up. It's clear that you knew the victims. I'm sorry to dig up bad memories. I can still see the poor child lying burned on the floor of that room. We had to tear him off. The marks must still be there. They're in my mind anyway. It's horrendous. It's I'm bad. Need your experience to bring him justice, Officer Brown. Can you explain what this painting is doing here? That was easy. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene. Wait, 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 wait. Last guy who went in here only smiles from the left cheek. You wanna go back along his trail. So the one cut the one cat cut up was Officer Bradley. Look at his left cheek. My car's parked down the way. Ooh, this is bad. Andrews, would you This is bad, boys. I feel this is a trap. This is a trap. Her again. Cat? This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, you've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. Oof. Who are you? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Oh! Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? Who the hell are you? We just met. What are you doing on my turf? Ooh. I've got my eye on you. We'll meet again. Like I care. Bye bye. Far, this mansion. Look behind you, at the top of the ridge. You see the building? Yes. That's the Hawkins mansion. Come on. We got some driving to do. I do not like the sound of that. Well, everybody, as the word of my beautiful mother says, it's my bedtime. So, I'm going to see y'all. See you guys in the next episode of Call of Cthulhu. As always, this is uh, episode number 69, live from my mom's basement. I'm out of 5,000. Oh